So this is what they found when they dug two feet down. You've got things like this with holes in it. Over here you have blocks sticking out. You have there obviously that giant sandstone slab was buried up at least two feet if not more. So it does look like there was some kind of mud wave that came through the area. And everything is so thrown around. And it's such a complete mess that not only was it a mining operation after the arrival of the Spanish, but prior to that, you just have all of this sign of devastation that happened. And it's good that they left this stuff in situ because it lets us hopefully see what it looked like at Pumapunku when this dramatic event happened. Like here. Keystone cuts. Well, the thing that Chris that Chris Dunn pointed out is that, you know, what they would do or what, you know, assuming they use technology like what we have, you can't say that, that they did, but what he said is they had to, in order to produce multiple flat surfaces, this is perfectly 90 degree angle, you have to have a flat surface. So if they produce this as the flat surface, then this lies down because that is your gauge of where you start your work. And then from there, then what I'm going to do is take this thing and then measure the distance at the top and see how consistent it is from top to bottom. I just want to show this though, because this is set at the distance to the outer part of this channel groove. And as we go down and down and down, it's really quite consistent. It might vary by a millimeter, but that's about it. All the way down to the bottom part. So human eyes and, and human hands can't do that. Want to get that photograph? Yeah, I'd like to get it. Yeah. And just, yeah, you know. Boy, is it varying that much? It, no, it's not varying by even a millimeter, oh, I don't think. Oh, Dr. Shock's going to. See what he thinks. Yeah, it's pretty consistent. No, no, it's not. It's pretty consistent. And then there's space on these. It's kind of interesting. Yeah. Okay, so here's the real test. Are they using metric system? Uh, 3.5 between them. Uh-huh. Started it on two different holes. Yeah, that's bang on. Okay, can yeah. you just go down the series? Yeah, and... that's bang on. So they are... That yeah. was the mistake I made. Okay. <laughs> Brick, Jesus. Look at that. <laughs> that's crazy. That's great. <laughs> that is crazy. So what's the distance? <laughs> I don't know. Probably some sacred distance. Uh, is that metric? Uh, it's got both. Oh, good. Okay. Wow. That that is off the scale. So what what do we have? It's uh, thirty one. Mil let's see, thirty one, thirty two point five millimeters. Okay, and in thirty two point five. Geez, the one inch, a quarter. Let's see, sixteenth. Uh, let's see, four or five sixteenths, one inch and five sixteenths. Okay, perfect. 